So I've been in my new apartment for just over a week. In that time, I've been all over the city to find things to turn it from a house into a home. I've managed to find two artworks that were around $60. I've retouched them, edged them and hung them on the wall. Ruben, my beautiful partner from Brisbane, bought me flowers that I've been able to use to decorate the house. Uh, and I've made a beautiful almond and plum cake with plums that were given to me by my boss. So it has been a full on week. I've also worked full time, retouched an image of a cat, and I'm going to edit this video. So thank you for joining me. It was great to be able to share my first week with you. Albert and Jamie, this is for you. I hope you love it. See you soon. Thank you for joining me on this video. My name is Cara Burns. I'm a photographer, a researcher, and recently moved to the beautiful city of Melbourne where I grew up. I'm gonna spend the next six months here in Melbourne rediscovering the things that I first loved about photography, sharing with you some portraits uh, and some images from the past, and also hopefully inspiring you to get out the camera, do something creative, or follow your passion. Uh, the unit that I'm in at the moment, I rented off the internet. Uh, I didn't get a chance to see it before I moved in. I want a big shout out to a friend of mine, Omar, who came and had a look at it on my behalf. And thank you to my real estate agents who decided to rent it to me, even though um, they'd never met me before. The place itself is a little bit rudimentary. I will say that there's definitely some things that need to be improved. But I'm living right in the middle of the city, really close to the State Library. And I think it's just a magical opportunity for me to be, be involved in the city and its people. So thank you for tuning in uh, and listening to this first video on the first night in my new place in Melbourne. Um, if you're interested in hearing any particular stories from Melbourne or um, if you think that I should go to any places, I haven't... I haven't lived here for many, many years. So if you have any ideas about what I should do, please shout out. Um, and what I'm also hoping to do is to share with you a portrait that I took today. I, I was fortunate that as I came into the unit, I got to meet my neighbor, Ludwig, who has two cats, Millie and Molly. And so I took a portrait of his beautiful white cat, Molly. So thank you again for joining me and I look forward to sharing with you the unfolding adventure over the next six months. Have a great night and I'll catch you soon.
So both of these paintings are absolutely stunning and they were a bargain only at $60 each. I did have to jump on a train and go to the outer suburbs of Melbourne to get them and as you would expect for 60 bucks they don't have frames. So what I'm going to do is I've actually found some house paint in the apartment. I'm just going to edge them with the house paint. It's the same colour as the doors and I'm going to hang them up and appreciate them and uh, decide if I want to frame them at a later date. I hope you like them. I think they're amazing. Can't wait to show you.